very sadly. A few months ago in August, the CS uh, Transport Murkom and went to Kenya Power, uh, to JKIA, fired individuals, uh, told the country that generators have been fixed, but yesterday it was a disaster. Uh, how can you lose electricity as a generator at a critical national asset, uh, like Jomo Kenyatta International Airport? I think the minister must apologize to the country for lying to Kenyans that the generators were working, yet he knew very well they were not working. It is an embarrassment. The other day, JKI rooms were leaking. He formed a committee to look into leaking rooms. Now, I hope he is not intending to form another committee to look into why generators are not working. Because the generator to work is very simple. Every Kenyan knows how generators work. Unakanyaka, unafruta maratatu, na generator inawaka, and you have electricity. So do we need an explanation to that? I think that this is the incompetence of the CS of roads and transport that are, is not only incompetent, but he lied to Kenyans that generators are working, and yet they are not working. And therefore, these are critical national strategic assets of national security importance that you should not even lose at 10 seconds, even power outage. In JKI, you can imagine the place that was supposed to land. Therefore, it must be, it must, it must apologize to this country and Kenyans. And, I, and you know, the last time he came to Nandi, the other man, he came and insulted me and called me a Kilikidogo. I thought he has fixed a generator. So, who has a Kilikidogo now? Because if you cannot fix a generator, where well, Unakanyaka one, two, three, kick, the generator goes on and you are able to use. So, in fact, I thought he had finished fixing the leaking groups in JKI by the time he was insulting me.